This is what the normal bride will wear. This belongs to the groom. So the bridal costume. So I, I wear this. This is like this. This is called Ibu Grosang. Before, when I wear this, I use the belt. But now, I like it. People also like it. Then I wear modern style. So I wear this. This is very old. Lace belt. This is very old. 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 This one is about 90 years old, 89 years old. So you cannot get this anymore. You know, I have asked a few kebaya people to sew it for me. I, have, I still have this lace, but they say they don't know how to join it this way. I only have two pieces of this one, very special one. So we pray to Guan Yin. Basically, like, the first thing you notice, the Melaka people just say Malay. Because the ancestors are from Fujian, so they are more talking about Malay. Because these people are mostly from Nusantara, from Indonesia, that place. So they are more talking about Malay. In the terms of food, because the people from Penang mostly come from Thailand, mostly come from Myanmar, those type of districts in the north. So their food are a little bit different from those who come from Indonesia. But basically, both of them are also spicy food. So, two of them also have a little bit of spicy food. Then, the Melaka one, they have this ayam pong teh, which is more of the southern type of Peranakan food. But other than that, their spiciness and all, like petai and all this, both sides like to eat all this type of food. This one, we try to find for the younger ones to cut it thinly. That's the down lima purut, Thai ko kam hiuk. Then these older ones, we're going to use it for cooking. Now what you do is the chicken, after you wash it clean, dry it a bit. Use the paste that we have grounded just now. So after you have sauteed it for a while, you just put it in. And then you season it for one or two hours. Uh, two hours will be just nice. Okay? Curry, spicy, is an everyday lifestyle of Peranaka. Our house has every day of curry. You can eat it today, it's fish. 明天呢就是呃咖喱咖喱蛋啦，后天呢就是那那那个 normal 咖喱鸭嘛。If no curry, we will have the sambal. Somehow we will have something spicy. Otherwise, it's like something missing. No? So of course, 咖喱咖喱蛋 is one of the main thing that we must have during the New Year. It's a curry way of cooking, but what we do normally at home because we like to do it is we pound the chili, uh, including of the onion, garlic, everything we pound it together with the spices that we use. We grind it into powder form. Either we use the tumbo to pound or we use the batu gili. Uh, so when we pound it and then we do it, then after that we will season the chicken. Then when we cook it in, I would like to use the Indian pot to cook. Then when you use the Indian pot, but when I taste it from Indian pot, you know, I've been to some buffet. They put it in the Indian pot and it, it tastes really good.